just get better, but I think they were able to open stuff up and I was able to display what I could do because of what they were doing up front. You almost got a little bit of a bye week with, uh, you know, the week off. Did that help? And then this bye week, I mean, for a running back who's getting hit as much as you, how important is it to heal the body? Yeah, it's definitely important to heal the body, you know. Um, I think this year I take the recovery process even more seriously than I ever have. Uh, making sure I get my ice time, making sure I'm getting getting rest, getting sleep, and eating right. So I think that's it's really important, especially as a running back. You know, you take a lot of hits. So. What's what's the morning after a game when you carry the ball 20 times? What's the morning feel like getting out of bed? Uh, I don't get out of bed until I got to be here. <laughs> that's, that's the moral of it. Uh, I just I stay in bed until I got to come here, and then we you know we get a workout in. And, it kind of loosens up the body, but definitely sore. You know, got to got to run it out a little bit, but definitely I, I, won't, I won't be feeling good until about Tuesday. Ice baths. Ice baths definitely take. We got the cold tubs here that I that I get in and uh, use the trainers as much as I can. You volunteer for the cold tub and the ice bath, or do they have to? Prompt yeah, no, I get in there. You know, they don't tell it. They don't tell. They know they tell us. You know, it's probably important to recover, but they don't make us do anything uh, like that. So uh, it's up to you and how you want to feel on Saturday. And I'd rather feel like I haven't played. You know, we, you know, you get you get sore through practice and everything. Things. I want my body to feel, feel as, uh, as fresh as possible come Saturday. What do you remember last year about the championship game against Utah? Physical. It was a hard fought game. Um, you know, it came down to the wire, and I think that's you know, that's the kind of game you can expect from a team like this. You know, they're going to come out there and they're going to they're going to be sound on their details, and just we got to execute our our stuff. And I think that's what it, that's what it comes down to every week. Um, I think in, in games that we've lost, we hurt ourselves. It's not team stopping us; we're stopping ourselves. So I think it comes down to uh, executing our details and making sure we're uh, precise on that. You're actually an underdog at home. They got, you haven't been an underdog at home in a while. I mean, do you guys ever talk about stuff like that? Uh, I mean, definitely. I mean, you know, you, you feel you you don't want to talk about. I feel pressure. We don't feel the pressure of it, um, but you know, we're aware of it, and we know that we have a, a higher ranked team coming in here. But you know, we treat every game the same. We don't go out there and we're going to give it our all. Uh, we're not going to be intimidated by anything. And so uh, we know that Utah is a good team, and we know that they're going to go out there and be physical, and we just got to be physical with them. Do you guys feel like you can carry over some momentum offensively from the Oregon game to the Utah game? Definitely. You know, I think as an offense, we talked a lot about, you know, even though we, you know, as a team, we lost, I think as an offense, we progressed a lot. We progressed a lot as an offense, and we're like, hey, this is this is what we can do. We gotta. This is what we gotta do. This is this is how we have to do it every week. And so, yeah, we, we lost, but we also learned a lot. And I think we progressed. I think that was one of the better games we ever played as an offense. And so, um, I think we just gotta take that into this week. And when you look at Utah's defense, their front seven, um, what is it about their front seven that makes them tough? Uh, they're just, a, you know, they're a fast, physical team. You know, they got they got really good linebackers. They got a good D line. And, uh, you know, they got good edge rushers. So it's up to us, you know, make sure we're staying on their blocks and taking space, uh, taking space whenever we can. You know, the holes are going to close quick, and that's just college football. But especially against a team like Utah, uh, you know, just take your space and uh, keep it going throughout the game. And you personally, where did you benefit the most for, from the bye week? Just recovering, uh, getting my body, getting my body the rest that it needed. Um, you know, it's been a long eight weeks, and you know, we still got five more weeks, four more weeks, something like that. So um, just recover, recover, recover. That was my main goal.